one kidney has now lived inside these three people. It originally came from this woman, Sarah Fearing, who donated one to her brother Ray last June. He's had kidney disease for nearly half his life. I've, you know, reached end stage renal failure. A few days after the surgery came devastating news. The transplant did not take. The healthy kidney became damaged and needed to be removed. But fearing surgeons at Chicago's Northwestern Memorial Hospital offered an interesting option. He could become a donor himself. By July, that same kidney was successfully retransplanted in this man, Erwin Gomez, a surgeon whose diabetes had caused his own kidneys to fail. Uh, right now, I feel great. The strange journey of one kidney through three bodies could offer hope to the nearly 73,000 people on waiting lists for organ transplants. Well, what's groundbreaking about this particular uh, report? is our ability to remove a kidney from someone who's been successfully transplanted but is destroying the kidney due to their underlying cause of kidney failure. If you were able to remove this organ, you could put it into another individual who doesn't have the same cause of kidney failure, and that organ will fully recover and function entirely normally. Retransplantation is rare but has been done before in the U.S. and Europe. One case used a heart, others livers, but this kidney case is the first believed to include donors who are all still alive. Bioethicists say patients need to know the risks of accepting second-hand organs and shouldn't be coerced into it. There is a much higher risk of technical complications. We're having to do a fairly detailed reconstruction of blood vessels. Some transplant experts say organ recycling likely won't become common practice, most organs are too damaged and thrown out if they don't take on the first try. It's unclear how reused parts fare long term. Fearing is back on the waiting list and dialysis. You know, it's going well. And is glad to have been a part of what he considers a medical breakthrough. One kidney, two surgeries, and three patients may make doctors think twice about tossing a previously transplanted organ. It could still save a life. Noel Wagner, the Associated Press.